This is Barbecue Bob Cole. You know, jet setting general managers are quite common in radio today, but there had to be a first, and his name was Dusty Black. After graduating from TCU and managing their campus station, Dusty moved on up, made his way to K-Box and KMEZ in Dallas, where he'd spend the next 13 years in sales and then management. Well, there was a brief detour in Oklahoma City. But then Dusty got back to Texas, where every market he entered felt the impact. Listeners heard it, and the folks that worked for him felt it. The folks at SFX recognized his talent and proposed that he manage their Houston property and their San Diego property at the same time. He accepted the challenge, and later on, he was again asked to perform the same kind of feat, but just a little closer to home. While based in Houston and doing the hobby hop to Dallas, he also managed KTXQ and KKRW. While at Coda, his successful rebranding of that station led the station to ratings heights it had never seen and billing numbers that have yet to be challenged to this day. Sunny 99.1 has maintained its number one revenue ranking for 18 years. Then came Austin. That's where Dusty found home. That's where he and I and so many folks got to work together at Case and KVET AM and FM. And then in his spare time, he offered guidance and oversaw sister stations here in the great Lone Star State. It's been a heck of a ride for the man who's been named more than once as one of the 50 best radio managers in Radio Today by Radio Inc. Magazine, as well as one of the 10 most admired corporate managers. Few others could ever or would ever rise to that level of attainment and respect. And today, we honor everyone's great friend, a great manager, and a great radio man. Ladies and gentlemen, Dusty Black, a 2013 inductee to the Texas Radio Hall of Fame.